Hi there, I'm Martin Tyler, and this is the Bernabeu Stadium. All the talk is over, now the game is underway, and Barcelona have started it. Well, it is this mouth-watering fixture. Barcelona against Real Madrid. Alan, you don't need to say much more than that, really. No, the names say it all, Mark. He's in a goal! These two sides have agreed to play. Oh! Well, there's clearly no love loss between the home fans and this player. Sergio Busquets. Turn to Xavi. Cesc Fabregas. Good pass. That ball from Iniesta going nowhere. This looks dangerous from Messi. Sanchez goes for goal! Corner now for Barcelona. He drives for goal. That is a fantastic goal. Absolutely no chance for the goalkeeper. That volley flew in. Ball's coming towards him. He's made his mind up early. He knew exactly what he wanted to do with that. Well, it was a good set piece, Martin, but defensively, you have to ask one or two questions. They just weren't marking properly there. It's Barcelona in front. So elusive, Mesut Urza. Wonderful skill to beat his man. A forward position goes Iniesta. Xavi. Oh, and Barcelona have got a chance here. He's gone behind for a goal kick. Arbeloa. That's a real tussle for the ball. Here's Fabregas. Once again, looking for the pass to open up the opposition. Now the counter-attack could be on here. There was a lot of speed and sharpness in that counter-attack, but it wasn't quite enough. Yeah, a lot of the success of Barcelona can be traced back to the arrival of Johan Cruyff uh, as a player, and of course he returned as a manager. Great success in both roles. Yeah, well, one of the world's best, one of the world's greatest players, and uh, I think it was him, wasn't it, that uh, decided to go in a certain direction as to how the the team played it's here's a chance what a chance well out to save it here that's easy to see that's one of the easiest handball decisions he'll get in this game yeah i think so and even the player accepts it here he is with a chance he makes the shot and that's the goal that's brought them level people say that just get lucky in the box, but I don't think that is the case. It, he knows where to move, when to move. Yeah, and in his ability that is difficult to coach, I think it comes naturally to this lad. We're all level again. 1-1 one, one the score. It's messy. Now Fabregas. Now here's a chance to get forward quick. It could be in a goal. And here's the shot. Offside given Gonzalo Higuain. Just to get back to Johan Cruyff and what difference he made to Barcelona. Well, he did. I mean, he was obviously a fantastic player, but then he uh, instigated a philosophy of how the game should be played, and that remains true to this day. Here is a chap who's really deadly in front of goal. He's got the shots off, and he's scored for Real Madrid. There's nothing like one goal to give you the confidence for another, and that's just what's happened here. Barcelona have gone behind. Here is uh, Xavi. Didn't quite come off. And he's found his teammate by cleverly lifting the ball over the outstretched leg of the defender. Here is an opportunity. And he lets fly here. It's one of the great sights of the game, a quick counter-attack. We've had one here and it just, just failed to produce a goal. Yeah, I mean, you've got to give them credit for the way that they did create the chance. And uh, if they can keep up that kind of tempo, the way they move the ball forward, it's, uh, it's going to be positive for them. So for Barcelona, I think half-time will be the key. They uh, might change it, one or two players have got some good squad, haven't they? Very good bench. 
that might be the key to getting them back into it in the second half. And straight forward for Ike Casillas. Nicely done. Chance, Ronaldo. He's got the goal. And it's put in by Cristiano Ronaldo. And when we're looking at the top, top talents of the game, Cristiano Ronaldo obviously comes to mind. And he hasn't let us down again here. No, and I think what people don't appreciate, Martin, is how hard he works during the week on that training ground. And the scoreline is 3-1. They're passing it well here. Brilliant opening. It's a penalty here. Oh, he's missed it. Well, I would have put the house on him there. Half time whistle has gone, and it's 3 1 here. All that is at stake in this local derby. Well, it's still up for grabs despite the fact we've got a team leading at half-time, but it is only half-time in the derby. Well, it is. 45 minutes for the trailing side to come back, and I'd expect a spiky response from them. Good ball. Oh, the attack has done well, beating his man. Great opportunity. Got to be quick now. Cristiano Ronaldo, it comes the challenge. What a challenge. Wonderful effort. The service was superb. The shot wasn't. Yeah, there you go, on a plate, but just couldn't take advantage. Well, the best way to silence these boo boys is to put in a top draw performance. Well, here comes a substitution for the away team. the shooting from there and it would have been a goal but for the keeper yeah and it had a bit of whip and a bit of bend on it so he had to keep his eye on it well time is ticking away it's time for a change and here it comes long range effort very long range well that was a real waste well his teammates are giving him some stick out there and no wonder either PK now Messi and now Iniesta Oh, and they're on the counter-attack here. And this could be an opening for Real Madrid. The counter-attack was on, but in the end, it came to nothing. Supported well by his teammates. Sergio Busquets. And the pass cut out at a truly vital time. It's a shame for the player, really. He's a creative player, but that wasn't very creative with that pass. Neatly done. Good challenge by the defender. Very good control, though. Higuain. Barcelona's ball, Danny Alves. Xavi. Well executed. And they've cut it out. He could lay it off to the supporting player. So dangerous. Great strike. He has he can't miss. And it's in! The header! Great goal! What a day for him. Another shot, another goal. Well, you can see the confidence in him. I think he expects to score every time he gets the ball at his feet. But it's a good effort, and I think it was a good save. He could do nothing about it. The only criticism with the keeper you would have, Martin, is he didn't carry it away out of the danger zone. In quickly. Now it's Real Madrid's turn with Javi Alonso. Great, and hits it. Sloppy earlier in the game, but stopping that shot very well indeed. Yeah, he's picked himself up and uh, he's done well for his team there. Manager thinking for the away side, time for a change. going to be a goal kick. 
Well, double, whether it'll be trouble for the opposition, we shall see. Two new players. Well, the brilliance of Barcelona has been shut out today by the strength of the opposition. They put out the sun, really, it's an amazing performance from them. Unless Barcelona suddenly break through in these last few minutes, it's going to be a scoreline that will reverberate around the world. And this is very bad news for Barcelona today. And there's a teammate free in the middle here. Here he is with a chance. And he takes the shot. Well, they make videos of misses like that. I'm afraid that's one for the next video on the market. Well, I think his teammates will be moving about that for weeks to come. And up goes the board. There'll be two added minutes. Lionel Messi. And they've got the ball back and they want to use it. Get forward quickly. Good ball. It goes for goal! A goal! Well, they've got a goal back, Barcelona, but there's nothing to be really excited about at this stage. No, you don't want to go off having not done your best and they've kept plugging away. Plenty of goals for the paying customers today. 4-2. They've linked up well. The shot at the end of it. This could have ended his game. He seems to have pulled a muscle. And that is the final whistle here. Real Madrid have victory.